will be fine. That's much better. Breaking news in the war against the rebels. Earlier tonight, a rebel stronghold was successfully captured by our troops. The head of the group is one of the most prominent leaders and symbols of the underground resistance, none other than the brother of the alleged Freedom Phantom. The Phantom has been unmasked. His real name is Christopher Stone, a 32-year-old plumber. After a brief interrogation by our intelligence officers, the brother, Troy Stone, confessed to his participation in many crimes carried out by the rebel group. Now repentant, Troy Stone has agreed to send a plea to his brother to stop further terrorist activities. We take you live to a press conference at City Hall. Citizens of New York, 
A dark chapter in your history is drawing to a close. Here now is the brother of the Freedom Phantom with a special plea to his brother to desist from further fighting. My, uh, my brother and I, we were just bored and sort of drifted into crime at a young age due to a, a lack of direction or, or ideals and, and playing video games all night, violent ones. And the society we grew up in kind of abandoned us, you know, but it's never too late to straighten out. So, um, so Chris, for my sake and the sake of the new system, I, I beg you to stop your terrorist activities. They just surrender to the authorities and, and they'll treat you fairly. The Soviet government gives you their word of honor. Just please do as they ask. It is obvious that the heroic Soviet army has Everything once again... Everything I said was lies. They forced me, Chris. Don't believe this thing of propaganda. Keep fighting. Set us all free. Ah, ah. No stick. Get your hands. I stole it, spear. <clears throat> and now to the weather for tomorrow. I hear it is uh, getting colder, comrade Ileana? 